Okay, thank you for joining us for press conference two between um, Mauritius and uh, Malawi. Coach, just your overall, uh, coach, just your overall remarks with regards to today's game and how you gave uh, your girls perform another chance uh, to defend your title here in PE. Actually, uh, the performance have been extremely good because we have managed uh, to to score more goals, which we planned for today's game. And the, there was nothing that we would have done uh, from uh, scoring more goals. Uh, since the other teams, more especially Madagascar, was ahead of us in terms of goals. So this is what we planned for training. Uh, we, uh, we did many, many drills, uh, scoring drills, uh, attacking, and the pressing excesses for uh, this match. So uh, whatever we did, I think, he, it has given us some flows, huge flows. We have scored nine goals, which is good for us, and the, uh, we prepared very well. That's why we have uh, positive results today. Uh, and Coach Lamo, I just want to, did you have one eye on the Botswana game, even when your team was in action here today? Actually, from, from the beginning or from the hotel, which we're staying, I told my players and my panel that he, do not co uh, consider whatever is happening about uh, Madagascar and uh, and uh, Botswana, because uh, if we had that uh, eye for that game, I think it would have been disturbed. So I, I said, let's do ours here. Whatever is going to happen that side, we shouldn't mind. So I think we concentrated much on on this game, and uh, really we knew that we we're going to to beat Mauritius. And we're going to beat more goals because our game plan of our system, if we, we checked, uh, we played with the three defenders and put more attackers in the midfield and up front uh, third. So this is have really, really helped us because we really needed to, to score more goals. So that's the results from, from the game. And last question from my side, Coach. I just want to check with with, in, with regards to the VAR that was in action today. Uh, were you were you happy with uh, the decisions from it today? Yeah, really, really I was happy. Uh, there are some areas we need to, to polish up. We need to do well. Uh, we lack the, uh, the the wing back. Uh, we, I think from the left hand side, I think we are having some problems, but. He, Sometimes when you are celebrating, you score more goals, you, you tend to forget about those issues and you celebrate as the team is forging ahead. So I'm happy with that. Thank you. Coach, um, congratulations. Thank you. Um, you thank stay you. on course. Thank you. I mean, it's like you mentioned, when you came here today, mm -hmm. any of the three teams in your group yes. had a chance to go here. Would you say you had a tough draw? You know? Yeah. Tough talk is always there in, in, in football. When he, you look like you're starving, you look like he, you're having pro pro problems to reach in the next level. So we had a tough talk. We discussed with my panel and players, and the, we agreed one thing, that let's go and win with more goals. So we're happy with whatever happened today, and the, this is what we agreed. And the use of VAR, you guys get exposed to it when you come to Kosafa. Is there something that you would vouch for to even come into domestic football? I get your pardon? The use of VAR, you guys get to be exposed to it when you come to Kosafa. Mm. Is it something that you would like to also have when you go back home for the girls to know to be used to it and how it's used? Uh, actually, when you look at the, the team which you brought this year, is a team of local players. Of course, we expected to have our, uh, some players from abroad, but uh, with other issues, I think we, they failed to join us. But we wanted mainly, because I had the plan B for, for the local players. If this cannot work out, then let me use the local players. Uh, we, I'm supposed, or we're supposed to give them a chance to, to play so that we can expose them. They are good players, we must rely on them. Mm -hmm. And I think this is a very clear picture that uh, to other countries, we're supposed to do that. Let's also rely on our local players. But I had the, the mission for this uh, year's tournament because whoever is going to, to qualify, it's an automatic that they're going to play uh, AFCO, which is very, very much important to us. But uh, getting into 
semifinals and finals. I think it's going to be a token as well to us because we are champions. So we have to defend this uh, tournament. Are you checking the group that you're going to play, the, the, the guys in Group C? Who you like to Definitely, I think we're, playing, we're going to play Zambia, our, our neighbors. <laughs> so it's going to be another final. <laughs> that is some finals. So if we play Zambia and the results uh, come out as, as, as good as to us, I think I will regard that same final as, as a final game before we play the final one. I just want to ask you also about, you know, how Temwa has done so well, she keeps breaking records even the last weekend. I know she's not here, but she's a product of Malawi, a product of Kosafa. What words do you have for her? And are the girls getting inspired, you know, to see what she has done and how the tournament exposes them? We are proud of, of Temwa and, and Tabitha and the other players who did not uh, join the, the camp. We are proud of them and, the, and even the country. Um, they have been inspiring other players in camp. They have been talking to, to, to play, uh, their fellow players, even to me as their coach. We have been, they are wishing us uh, best wishes so far. So uh, it is uh, another good yardstick for them to do uh, outside. Because if we qualify for AFCON, I think uh, next year, and maybe we're going to join or play in Olympic Games or World Cup, I think. Uh, they're going to help us because that experience, the vast experience they're getting there, definitely, we cannot deny that it's going to, to, to help uh, uh, Malaya as, 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 as a woman football. Is she checking in with the team? Is she sending well wishes? Well wishes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, she's doing that. She's doing that. Sure. They're part of us. They're part of us uh, every day, uh, every game you're playing, after the game, we, we talk to each other. So they're part of the team.